You know what I just noticed? Like every time I film a video, I'm either in a white t-shirt or a work shirt. How's that for monotony? That's pathetic. What's up everybody? Zeph OTBS. Got a little Christmas cheer. Jason Wilman, Mr. Fisher Bike, and um, Michael. I think I know what that means. That's freaking Christmas package. Just going out on a limb there. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe that's what it is. Uh, Sevens was asking what what does that mean that you wrote on the envelope? That's my that's my wager. That's all I've got. It's my best guesstimate. I can't wait to get into this. This is going to be nice. Jason, thank you very much. Um, just so you know, still praying for you guys every single morning and every single night. Um, praying specifically for you and uh, the family of your wife. Um, and I uh, hope everything's getting back on uh, the regular. And it seems like it is. So I'm really, uh, really pleased to see you, you know, kind of backing around and you know, things seem to be getting back to normal, but uh, my prayers are still there for you and your family every day. I just want you to know that. Um, there's a few of you guys that I, that I pray for every day. Sorry to get a little religious, but um, that's just how I roll. I have a, have a prayer list every day, and uh, a lot of you guys, uh, y'all going through tough times, and I uh, just want you to know you... You are in my thoughts and in my prayers on a daily basis. Now, minute 57 into it, let's get to some cards. Here's a note. Alan, my main man, how can I say this? I love you, bro. You're a great friend. I enjoy our text we have and the similarities in collecting we have. Have a Merry Christmas, bud. Your pal, Jason, Mr. Fisherbike. That is wonderful. Thank you very much. I appreciate it everything about you and uh, so many of y'all I just really I enjoy I enjoy text I enjoy Facebook messages it's just nice to interact and really gain close personal relationships just through a hobby I mean it's really great um, but yeah again I'm gonna get off my soapbox cuz yeah I got stuff I need to do like this Two packages. I'm assuming this is first because this is last, so I'm going to leave that right down here. What do you think, Jack? Got the dog over here. He's just chilling. He was hanging out underneath this table, and I was like, yeah, no. You will totally get up in the middle of the video, and you will shake the entire thing, and it will fall over, and that will just not be good, and I'll get irritated, and it's just a lose-lose situation. Nice stuff. Nice wrap job too, Jason. Seriously, dude. We've got a uh, like a bulk snap case. Nice. And a Golden Tate X Fractor from Finest. What was this? Had to be a 2011. No, it's 2010. That's a rookie, but I don't... Duh. There's the rookie symbol right there beside him and I totally missed it go figure not surprised I can't honestly say I'm surprised very nice there were times uh, last year that I missed having Tate on the roster but then a little guy came along this year and his name is Tyler Lockett and I don't miss Golden anymore I love Tyler Lockett I, as a matter of fact let me talk some football let me do a little Brad 8671 on you I'm just going to talk Seahawks football. Um, I cannot wait for this year's contenders to come out because of the rookie class that Seattle had this year. Frank Clark, who is coming on strong here late in the season, Tyler Lockett, of course, and Thomas Rawls. That kid is a beast. Um, I was just talking to Ryan Curtis today about – uh, this rookie class, and I cannot wait for this year's contenders to come out. I hope none of them are redemptions, and I really hope they put Thomas Rawls in uh, in this um, this year's contenders since he was a late season stud, kind of the same way Doug Baldwin was back in 2011 when he came out as a rookie. Um, Baldwin was an undrafted free agent and uh, came on strong. 
about mid-season all the way through the end of the season, and they put him in contenders. And uh, he was actually – that was his first rookie card. Purden. Um, but, yeah, dude, oh, I'm so happy with Seattle finally finding their their feet. They've got the offensive line situation straightened out, and things are looking really good. But, you know, this is going to be a yearly thing now since they've paid everybody and they've basically spent all the money on – one selfish player um, and a couple other players which are not selfish that I love and I'm glad they're still there but one selfish player I don't even need to tell you who it was you know this is going to be a year after year thing until they can alleviate some of the uh, roster space and uh, not roster space but payroll space god I'm wasting so much time talking about this I'm sorry Topps Platinum Richard Sherman these are the thickies. Daddy. Very nice. Yes, baby. Okay, I'll open it in a minute, baby. And just go back downstairs with Mama, okay? Marshawn Lynch, Topps Platinum. I don't know if these were refractors or what. I think all Topps Platinum has that refractory look. Oh, this is a team set, I think. And Russell Wilson. And these are all from uh, 2014, Topps Platinum, I'm guessing. Oh, dude, I wanted to buy this set. I wanted to buy this set, the whole entire set when it came out. I think this is it. The Panini Super Bowl 48 set. This is my boy right here. I mean, seriously, Doug Baldwin. Love this guy. Love his attitude. Love everything about him. Y'all already know. I've already said it in the uh, game used uh, glove vid that I got from him from Garrett. Thank you again, Garrett. <laughs> and then from Valor, Paul Richardson, rookie. Paul can't seem to stay healthy. He's got good hands, but he can't seem to stay healthy. So that's going to be the downfall of that kid. Um, I like him, but I haven't seen enough of him to really form a solid opinion. But, I, I mean, what I, what I have seen, I do like. So, um, yeah. I don't really think he's going to stay on the roster. But, you know, I hope he does. Oh, look at this. I don't know what this is. Look at this. All right, we're going to slow roll this. Moo, what are you doing? Camera hog? Space hog? That's BGS 8.5. Look at this. Look at this. Nice, dude. I think I've seen this. I think I saw this on eBay. Maybe this was another one. But this is from 2002 Upper Deck Ballpark Idols. Uniform Slaughter's jerseys of Juan Gonzalez. I do not have this. I am happy to have this. I have a newfound love of BGS slabs. And uh, this is going to fit right in there. I dig. I dig very much. Jason, thank you, dude. Thank you very much, dude. I love it. Absolutely love it. You are the man. Making sure I was holding that up right. Thank you. Merry Christmas to you. I got you. Don't you even worry. I'm coming back for you. I'm gunning for you, dude. But thank you so much, man. I really do appreciate it. Appreciate all you guys, as always, for watching. Sorry I take what should be, you know, five-minute videos and turn them into 10, 15-minute videos. It's just I'm good at it, you know. You, you flex your skills when you got them, you know. And that's what I got, so that's what I do. Love you guys. Be good. Be nice. I love you. Y'all take it easy. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Love you.